And I do believe that we have rotten, rotten politics, and I'm, I'm not using that as an exaggeration. Hey everyone and welcome. In this video we're going to be having a look at an article regarding Hungary, and specifically Viktor Orban. Ooh, the bogeyman for the EU. <laughs> the man that constantly gives a pretty two-finger salute every time the EU tried to impose ridiculous rules on, other, on countries and member states. Now this time he's done something that will infuriate the left waffen as he has refused migration to solve demographic problems now you're probably wondering what he's going to replace it with if they've got a demographic problem he's going to focus on family values yep you heard that right we've finally got an mp that cares about his people absolutely brilliant now you're probably wondering what he's actually said he's actually said that he's going to focus on christian family values instead of relying on mass migration to mitigate problems with his demographics he actually said and i quote what we need is not newcomers instead of our own people originally living here because it's just a mathematic approach if we invite others from outside europe that will change the cultural identity of europe he said there are some countries that accept it but hungary are not among those countries neither is the uk but the leaders do and that's all that matters apparently even though they were voted in on changing that are you listening tories do your freaking job jesus he also said we would not like to change the cultural identity of our country so we don't accept migration as a solution to demographic problems demographic politics or demographic challenges under new legislation women are exempt from paying income tax for life if they re raise four or more children what a great policy exempt for life for income tax perfect the government also introduced a loan scheme for women under the age of 40 who are getting married for the first time with the cost of the loan will be entirely forgiven if the family raises three children is anyone else feeling very very jealous at this point other policies include suspending and eventually forgiving the student debts of women as they have children grandparents leave and support to buy a family home and family car so investing in his own people including the ladies perfection is it not now if you're wondering how well victor orban's doing well apparently the policies have all borne fruit so far hungary state secretary for family youth and international affairs Catalin Novak told Breitbart the recent demographic figures speak for themselves the number of marriages is at its 40 year high the fertility rate is at a 20 year high while the divorces haven't been as low as last year in the last six decades so this is how it's done do you think any of our multicultural liberal toss pots will do the same no, neither do I. Let me know what you think, though, everyone. Do you think we should do the same? Do you think we've got any politicians that have got the political will to do the same? Because I don't. I think we're infected with cowardice, weakness, and just out-and-out -out jellyfish-spined cretins. <laughs> Numpties of the highest order. But let me know what you think, everyone. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit the like, comment, subscribe. Hungary, if we can figure out cloning technology, can we have a Victor Orban for ourselves? <laughs> Stay sane. I'll see you on the next one.